Sir. <clears throat> Well, you wouldn't expect him to win the frame at this visit with the three reds where they are, brown on the cushion. But a good chance to get right back in the game. Twelve. Now, if he decides to play for the black here, it's going to be more difficult to get on to the reds. I believe he's left this a little straight, so I may have to play for the black. Just has enough angle to get to the reds. He's got to put all his concentration into the black, not the position. Nicely played. Couldn't have played it any better. And again, it's important to leave a nice angle on the black here to come back to the reds again. Well, not quite that much of an angle. And he'll be upset with that one. Trying to force the cue ball over to the right side of the table to give himself an angle to dislodge the reds, maybe. Now, just four points behind, so doesn't need to bring the pink into play. But it could be an option to play safe off the pink as we look at the shot again. Trying to come over a little further to leave the angle to be able to go back towards the reds. Blue ball. Oh, well, come. I'm not sure about that one. I put the blue safe. He's going to need the blue. Could have played the cue ball off the pink into the jaws of that corner pocket Again, he couldn't have got any closer, could he? Without that red ball dropping in. How close is this? in his queuing. Can't possibly be taking this one on. Mark Williams, three. <coughs> Marcus Campbell just may take this one on. 
seven points behind, so he's going to need that blue now. Where's the red going to finish? That wasn't a good kiss on the black for him. And if he takes a green with this red, he'd only be able to tie Marcus Campbell if he got down to the blue. Calculations. <coughs> yes, if you can get the bark colours now, wouldn't need the blue. <coughs> Three. Yes, if he pots yellow, green, and brown, it'll be 19 ahead with. 18 on. Five. And underscrewed that one. Wanted to be top side of the green to be able to come to the brown. And that was a careless positional shot, you have to say, from Mark Williams. He's got the cue ball back up the table, but he's not on the brown. Eight. Uh, he's just struggling, isn't he, so far this morning? And for all that he did play, play well in China, it's been 12 years since the winner of the event before the World Championship went on to win at the Crucible as well. So Campbell now needs the last four colours. Mark Williams would need just the brown. First frame went down to the colours. And this has followed a similar pattern. Neither player at their best yet. helped with the blue, bringing the blue into play, but he could find himself in trouble here. Mark Williams can screw that cue ball in behind the blue. And that will do. So, Marcus Campbell not only has to hit the brown, but has to get it safe. No idea where the brown's going to go. Well, Williams needs the brown to leave, Campbell needing a snooker. Expected him to pot that the way he's been playing lately, but uh, as I said, so far this morning, he's not really come to life. No, he hasn't settled as yet, has he? Again, got so close to that, just concentrated on getting the brown, didn't play position on the blue. It doesn't matter what you've won or what you've done in the game, the crucible can still bring on the nerves. We saw that last night with Stephen Hendry, although he finally came through in a decider against Zhang Ander. <coughs> Half an hour for the frame. And counting. Well, 
Well, he's knocked the pink into a slightly safer position there, which will help him. That's William.